Hey, welcome to Ryan M. Outdoors channel. Wanted to do a little product review for everybody. Uh, I got the Ingle cooler here uh, that I have really enjoyed for my minnows. It's a live bait cooler that has uh, great latches on it and it's insulated. You could even put ice in here and pop if you really wanted to. Uh, but it's a really cool cooler. Uh, it has a, a basket that comes out with it uh, that some people like, some people don't necessarily like, but uh, it definitely, uh, I, I like it. It's a nice feature because you can scoop up your minnows uh, pretty easily. And uh, yeah, it's got your minnows right there uh, for you. And uh, fits in there nicely. But I really like these latches. They're nice, strong latches. Uh, but yeah, uh, pick yourself up a Ingo cooler uh, at the stores, any uh, fishing tackle store near you. Um, most tackle stores near you. But I want to do a, a product review for uh, Ingo Coolers here. Uh, they were kind enough to send me a, uh, their latest product, and I'll get to that here in a second. But uh, I want to do a little comparison first. Uh, the first aerator I ever had for my minnow bucket was um, in the Fraybill aerator, and uh, it's battery operated. Uh, I got two uh, D size batteries for it, and uh, it's, it's got just uh, one speed on it. You just hit the red switch here and uh, it's got one speed. Uh, the only thing with this is it's kind of loud. Uh, so when you're filming, uh, it's, it's kind of loud in the background, especially if you're ice fishing in the tent. I've noticed on my videos that, that it can be loud at times. Um, but uh, that's the first one I got and it's got a hook on it that hooks right onto your bait uh, cooler. So uh, that, that was the first one I got. And then when I switched to uh, these Ingle coolers, uh, this one came with uh, two by two air pump gen 2 aerator uh, which uh, is a two speed pump two-way power and this too is also battery operated uh, what you do is you undo the uh, back cover here uh, there's a little screw that you undo and once you pop that out uh, then you take off this cover here and it's got two uh, D batteries here and uh, so it's, it's very much similar to the uh, Freybill one. Um, a few things with the single air pump is um, it, you don't use rechargeable batteries with it and don't submerge or operate the pump in water. Uh, and also do not clean with detergent or harsh chemicals. Uh, but it does have a little uh, charging port here on the front there that uh, you can charge with when, you, uh, when you're out on the water, you can either Use your Dakota uh, lithium battery or charge it at home. And uh, the difference with this and the Fraybill is this one actually has two speeds. Uh, however, it is a little bit louder than the Fraybill one. So when you're ice fishing and you're out in a tent, um, it can be pretty loud when you're filming especially and can get a little annoying. Uh, but the tube uh, goes right in here and then plugs right into your cooler here. Uh, so that's a two by two air pump. And then Ingle Coolers uh, hooked me up with this, uh, their newest product here, uh, this aerator, which is pretty, pretty handy. Uh, this has several features that I love on it. Uh, it's got a um, uh, electromagnetic pump with uh, no rotational parts, gears or cogs, therefore nothing uh, uh, ever uh, seizes or breaks. Um, it's got lithium ion USB-C rechargeable battery, which is uh, great. I always plug this into my uh, Dakota lithium uh, traveling battery when I'm out on the water, uh, which is perfect. Um, it's a rechargeable battery with a 36 hour life. And uh, so that's, that's really nice. And the USB-C port goes right here in the side. Uh, so that's, that's super handy because we're always charging our cell phones. And uh, so might as well use the same uh, cord uh, to charge this up too. So you can always keep a charge up on the water. Uh, it's got four speed and intermittent options, uh, which is super handy. You just click it on here and it's got four different speeds. Uh, you can uh, plus or minus the button here. And it's also got a uh, 10 second intermittent timer, which really stays on your battery as well. So that's a really cool feature that Ingle Coolers has, has offered too. Uh, it's got marine grade salt water resistant stainless steel hardware. Uh, so that's handy. Um, sealed watertight with internal gasket uh, to protect the battery and electronics, which is cool. Uh, it's ultra quiet. That's what's really going to be the key to my filming, especially ice fishing in the tent, is it's going to be super quiet. 
uh, so that's awesome. It comes with a silicon hose, uh, USB cable and plug adapter. It's got all kinds of cool features and also a stone to put into your cooler here. So a uh, two year limited warranty as well, so you can't beat that. So uh, yeah, I appreciate Ingle Coolers for hooking me up with this aerator and uh, I'm really super excited to use this out there on the water and, uh, and for filming too. So thank you Ingle Coolers and uh, be sure to go pick you up a cooler if you haven't done so already. Uh, I got the 13 quart here, uh, which is super nice. And uh, yeah, I've really enjoyed it and I can use it as a cooler too. So now let's get on the water and uh, get to fishing. Come here, minnow. All right, got a minnow out of my Ingle Cooler bait bucket. So we're gonna hook this right through the eye. Put this out on a bobber stopper. Let's see if we can catch bass. Well, we got a little bass here. This is actually an upgrade from the first bass. I got my hook swallowed here. He crushed that minnow, that's for sure. Thank you so much for watching, and be sure to like and subscribe to this video. See you on the next one.